call the meeting of the Women's Issue Committee to order. Good morning, I am Council Member Karen Koslowitz, Interim Chair of the Women's Issues Committee. Today we are holding this hearing to vote on Resolution 1292, a resolution calling upon the New York State Legislature to pass and the Governor to sign legislation amending the real property law to allow victims of domestic violence to terminate leases upon written notice to landlords. Domestic violence is a pervasive issue that we need to keep on speaking out about. Domestic violence can happen to anyone, no matter your socioeconomic status, your race, or your gender. It can occur a couple weeks into a re relationship or decades later. Domestic violence comprises 15% of all violent crime in the United States. More than 10 million people per year are victims of domestic abuse. While we know that domestic violence has no face, we also know that a disproportionate number of victims are women. In leading by example, we are voting on a resolution today which aims to empower victims of domestic violence. Many victims of abuse feel trapped in their living situation and feel suffering financial penalties, poor tenant history, and bad credit from breaking their lease. Resolution 1292 would call on the New York State Legislature to guarantee that there is a safer and faster avenue for domestic violence victims to terminate their lease. Re research has shown that leaving an abuser is the most dangerous time for a victim of domestic violence. This legislation would help eliminate one of the many obstacles that victims confront when trying to escape their abusive relationships. The legislation would also allow thousands of New Yorkers to leave abusive situations without risking the safety or economic stability of their families. I'd like to thank the sponsor of the legislation, Council Member Rosenthal, and of course, thank you to the members of the committee on wi women's issues that are present, which is Council Member Crowley and Council Member Kalos. And the committee staff, Council Aminta Kilowan and policy analyst Joan Pavoni. Now I'd like to turn the floor, well, she's not here, so I can't turn the floor over to Helen Rosenthal. And with that, we'll have our vote. William Martin, committee clerk, roll call vote, Committee on Women's Issues, Resolution 1292. Council Member Kozlowitz. I vote aye. Crowley. I vote aye. Kalos. I vote aye. By a vote of three in the affirmative, zero in the negative, and no abstentions, item has been adopted by the committee. Thank you, and with that, the committee is over.